Hey guys, what's up? Ty Ty the Gamer Guy here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Crystal. In the last episode, we explored the Lake of Rage, battled a shiny Gyarados, and we met a Pokemon trainer by the name of Lance. And he has discovered that this little shack in, in Mahogany Town is hiding some is hiding something. That is that involves with the forced evolutions of the Magikarp in the Lake of Rage. So, let's climb down these stairs and see what's up. And here we have one of the most annoying parts of the Johto games. There are these Persian statues. Why are they annoying? You'll see exactly why. Every time you walk in front of one, the alarm goes off and you are forced into a battle against not one, but two rocket grunts. And you have to and you have to get past quite a few of these Persian statues. And every time, you have to you have to fight two rocket grunts. Because I don't feel like showing these fights over and over again. This will probably be the only this will probably be the only one that I do show. Of course, you're at minus one accuracy and you still hit hypnosis, which is 60% accurate. Do I have a sleep curing item? A full heal. I'm not wasting a full restore. I'm just gonna have to use a full heal. I'll have to, I'll have to stock up on some more um, status ailment items later. Alright, hit him with Munch Lap again. Hopefully he misses Hypnosis again. Get Disable, okay, and smile at me. And Swift. I'm not using Flame Wheel because Drowsy has really good special defense and critical hit, yeah! And Zubat. And no, I don't want to switch. And Flame Wheel. Grilled Bat. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Dang, I failed! Yeah, it goes off twice and you're forced into a second battle. Why couldn't they just do one battle? Like, seriously, this part of the game is so annoying, honestly. This is probably the part again that I dread the most whenever I play through Johto. But hey, I guess it's but, hey, I guess it's easy experience. All right, flame wheel. And the Lafia might, well, probably not level up from the Zubat, but the next one maybe. Nope. Okay. Of course. And a Grimer. All right, mud slap. Make him even dirtier than he already is. And harden. Go ahead, make yourself hard all you want. <laughs> all right, and nice. And level thirty-two. If I chose Chikorita, um, it would be evolving into its final stage by now. <laughs> and Rattata. Yeah, these grunts have. All the Ninja have pretty weak Pokemon. So it's easy experience, but it's not that much experience. Surveillance cams are on the Pokemon statues. Yeah, uh, yeah, I just kind of figured that out. And explained it to everybody watching. Alright, there's one right, right over there. I think we can actually skip that one for now. Is there a hidden item here? Nope. Our uh, item over there, we have to get past that person's statue. I think we have to go that way anyway. Another item and a scientist, I believe. This was once a ninja at the hideout. There are traps to confound intruders like you. Oh, you suck at setting traps because I haven't come across any traps besides those annoying Persian statues, 
which do nothing but beep and alert two rocket grunts that have really easy Pokemon to defeat and make me stronger just by doing it. Alright, Mud Slap. Probably shouldn't be using that too much because it, it, it also has only has 10 PP. But I guess it, it does lower accuracy, which I guess, you know, somewhat makes sense, but still. That was a absolutely no excuse for Vine Whip to only have, yeah, 10 PP. Yeah, my electric type versus your electric type. And my newly evolved electric type at that. It, fe it feels weird to not see an Elekid's back sprite anymore. Cause I get, I've had I've had this I've had this thing ever since she hatched from hatched from her egg, quite a few episodes ago. She's been with us for a long time. And fire punch. And that's it. And Jed, I get it. Well, what do you get? Alright, what's this? A guard spec, I don't remember what that does. I think that protects you from... Um, stat lowering moves, maybe? I don't know. I've never used the item- I've never used the item before, so I don't know what it does. And we have another Persian statue right here. Yeah, these two rock girls even had the exact same Pokémon. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely gonna be cutting these battles out. It's literally just the same battle over and over again. Who thought that was a good idea? Hyper Potion. And I believe we have at least one more Persian statue to get through. Critical hit, yeah! Level 33, yeah! Alright, I got poison in that fight, and luckily I have an antidote. Now, I'm gonna have- oh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna have Audrey be in the front for a little bit. The Slovakian has gotten quite a f bit of levels just from these Persian statues alone. And a nugget, that's an item for selling. And, of course, one more person statue. And they even have the same text. <laughs> okay. Now that's the last person statue, thank god. Are you alright? The Pokemon are hurt and tired. Here, give them some of my medicine. So I just wasted one of my antidotes. Ty, let's give it our best for our Pokemon. All right, another rocket grunt. Hopefully, luckily, this one isn't a, like a repeat for the fifth time. What Pokemon do you have? You have two. And Venonat. Finally, something actually different. I don't think we've even seen a Venonat yet before. Unfortunately for Audrey, I he can't. She can't do a darn thing to that thing. Oh, well, she might be able to. How much will Acid do? It's resisted, but I am higher leveled by quite a bit at, as well. All right, yeah, I can do this. Nope. That's awkward. But it doesn't do much damage, at least. And I know grass is quad resisted, but it's at very low HP. Can it finish it off? It can. All right. Next, we have another Venonat. Electabuzz almost got a level up from the last Rocket Grunt, so let's go ahead and give her, give it to her right now. And Fire Punch. Critical hit, yeah, even though it didn't matter. Level 31. Brr. Yeah, I'd be growling too if I lost. Anything over here? Anything at all? Nothing. Alright. 
So I probably will battle all the rocket runners because, you know, once you clear everything out of here, you won't, any, one, any runs that you skipped out on, you won't be able to battle again. So that's free experience you're, you're going to be passing up. Now let's switch Leviathan to the front again. The door won't open? Well, duh, it has to have a password that only Team Rocket knows. A Golbat! A grunt with an evolved Pokemon, actually. It's still under level one at that, because Zubat evolves at level 22, not 18. Alright, Flame Wheel. Let's see if this will one shot. It's boosted from the uh, charcoal as well. Ah, oh, almost. Oh well. Finish it off with Warp Star, like I'm Kaboo from the Kirby Rap Pack Gatja anime. Grunt was defeated. What? I lost? Yes, you indeed did. You have, you have to say anything else? <laughs> I'm just a grunt. I don't know the password. Too bad for you. It takes two passwords to get into the boss's quarters. Those passwords are known only to a few rockets. That rocket there very graciously told me so. Tyler, let's go get the passwords. Urgh, that guy in the cape is incredibly tough. Yes, if you want to be tough, just wear a cape. Everybody will fear you. We have a couple grunts right here. Do I know the password? Maybe. But no weak is gonna get it. And hey, it's Cassidy again. In Ekans. I think like it says in the anime. And Flame Whale. Down it goes. What else you got? Gloom. Very easy pickings. Flame wheel once more. Burn that butt on its head to a crisp. And evaporate the drool coming out of its mouth. A critical hit, yeah, even though it didn't matter. Uh, I swear, that's gonna be the, the the new trend in this Let's Play. Like, in Pokemon Blue, it was always Critical Hit Yeah! Now this one, it's Critical Hit Yeah! Even though it didn't matter! Alright, over here with another scientist. More free experience for Quilava. And I didn't even read what um, the other Rocket Grunt said because I was too big focused on battling this one. She might have given us the, she might have given us the password. Ross? Ross Delgado? Ross from Friends? Wait, no, it's... It's... F uh, oh my god. What's that guy's name for Billy Manny? It's not Ross... It's not Ross Delgado. It... Host... No. I don't remember. It's like the, the really buff guy with a... Really deep voice. He talks like this. And he's like super badass. And he has eye patch. And he has... A missing hand with like... Interchangeable weapons and such. I probably sound nothing. I probably sound nothing like him, but uh, I'm doing the best I can. I'm gonna stop now before this gets weird or annoying. Whichever one comes, whichever comes first. I th I think it's Hoss Delgado. If it, if it, if, it, if that's even his last name, I, I don't remember. It's been a long time since I've seen that show, but I love that show. Although my mom hated it. <laughs> Especially that one episode. Especially on that one episode where Billy says, "Destroy us all! Destroy us all!" over and over again. Whenever that episode was on, she made me mute the TV until until that scene was over. All right, what does this grunt have to say? The password to the boss's room is Slowpoke Tail because, of course, it is because for some reason they have an obsession with cutting off Slowpoke Tails. And she also said that we need two passwords to get into um, the boss's quarters. And more grunts for us to fight, and two items! Uh, X special, I don't care about that. Running out of um, space for items. 
you know, back in the days when Pokemon actually had limited um, inventory in your bag. Thank God they changed that in Diamond and Pearl and so on. And eradicate. Eradicate. <laughs> Sorry if I deafened any of you. And quick attack. Yeah, whatever. Just give me my level up. Do 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 do. Level thirty-four. Rocket Grunt was defeated. Yuck, yuck, yuck! You're good. Notice that the scientists gave us way more money when we defeat them, and that's a, a protein! I want that, I want that, that increases attack! Uh, what do I not need? I don't need apricorns. I don't plan to make any Pokeballs from them. So we'll just get rid of them. Alright, give me that. I'm gonna save this protein, however, because a lot, a lot of my team members are, um, well, are a special attackers, but Audrey's a mixed attacker. Either way, I think this will be better suited for something else. I don't care that Pokemon are hurt by our experiment. I, oh, 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 this guy has a Ditto. Ditto is an interesting Pokemon. It, of course, I misroll out. It used Transform, and it transformed into a purple Lavathi, and that- I actually really like that detail. When it transformed into a Pokemon, it still keeps its purple coloring. I kind of wish that they, that they did that still in the, um, afterward, in the later games. It actually looks really cool. When a Ditto transforms, it copies your stats all, your, and your moveset, except for HP. So, and- ooh, Mudslap. And Mudslap can't- it- Okay, the animation from Mudslap does not look very <laughs> appetizing from Kulava's front sprite. Because it looks like it's, you know, it's pooping all over me. <laughs> I'm sorry, that, that's what it looks like. It looks like that with Umbreon, when Umbreon uses Sand Attack as well. Uh, I gotta love um, Gen, Gen 2 sprites, awkward sprites with attack animations. Alright, well... And finish it off with Thunder Punch. And it didn't kill. How did that not kill? It, oh god. You know what? Fight fire with fire. You're faster. It, it was a speed tie. Because of course it was. <sighs> Alright, fine. Guess Electabuzz isn't going to get the experience. Thinking is my strong suit, not battling. Okay, do I have a revive? I have two. Alright, half health should be good enough for her. Alright, let's go up here. Another item. Ice heal. And that was actually a mistake in a couple episodes ago, where I said that the ice berry like freeze like heals the free status when it actually doesn't. It cures burn, which makes sense, but it's very yeah, it's very easy to confuse. And I got a notif notification on my phone about something. Okay, it's over here. Another rocket grunt. No way, I want to battle him. I wanted to, meant to walk in front. I was kind of hoping that he was going to see me. I'll cut this battle out, though, because we're already pretty high up there in the, on the timer. I knew I'd lose, though. Why'd you battle me? Alright. Uh. Oh. Look who it is. Didn't I tell you that I was, that I was going to destroy Team Rocket? You didn't say anything like that. Tell me, who was the guy in the cape who used Dragon Pokemon? My Pokemon were no match at all. I don't care that I lost. I can beat him by getting stronger Pokemon. It's what he said that bothers me. He told me that I don't love and trust my Pokemon enough. I'm furious that I lost to a, to a bleeding heart like him. 
Hmm. I don't have the time for the likes of you. So then he punches us. And we got an Ultra Ball. Wait, do I have the passwords already? I have one of them. Okay, it looks like I don't. Not yet, at least. Another item. TM46. What is that? Oops, 46. Thief. That is a dark type move. Another type that's introduced in Generation 2. I don't think I have anybody that. Uh, wait. Dynamo can learn it, but nah, I'm not gonna teach it to her. And actually, since we're coming up pretty high on the timer, I think I'm gonna stop it right here. Actually, no. I did cut up quite a few battles thanks to the Persian statue, so I think I'll go a little bit further. At least until we get the second password, where, like, whoever has it. I got wiped up. I'm skipping through his dialogue and trying to read at the same time. Not a good combination. Alright, where's that other password? Radicate Tails! So what, you're cutting off Radicate Tails too? I, mean, I wouldn't expect, you know, rat tails to be, uh, you know, like, nutritious and delicious, but you do you. I mean, there are people out there that do eat rats, but, uh... Why am I even talking about this? Anyway... Let's see if this will do it. The door is closed. Tyler entered the two passwords. The door opened! And just like that, we have access to the boss's quarters. But, I think we're going to save it for the next episode, because we're coming up on the timer. I will see you guys next time.